remember the first time I broke the sound barrier. I was in a T-38. I remember my first formation flight, my first missing man, my first unrestricted high-performance climb. After 25 years and almost 1,500 hours in the jet, seems the T-38 never gets old. The human body is an incredible machine. We cross great distances on foot or even by swimming in water. But to become airborne, humans need the aid of other machines, like the one behind me. It's a tandem seat, twin engine, supersonic jet that we here at NASA operate as an essential part of our spaceflight readiness training program to prepare astronauts to fly in space to another incredible machine. That machine is an orbiting laboratory that is celebrating a quarter of a century of flight. After 25 years of service, the space station remains a place for research and discovery. Its story is far from over. As I said earlier, the machine behind me, the T-38, is one of the many ways that we train to fly in space. Come along, let's go for a spin. Thank you for watching this 500th edition of Space to Ground. So long.